Hello, Hackbank here, and I just wanted to say real quick, if you've been enjoying my content, please remember to subscribe to the channel here on YouTube and follow me on Twitch so you can always catch us when we're live and see more content. Also, if you are new here, welcome in, and if you're enjoying the video, please remember to like it because it helps me out a lot. I also post funny clips and other things on TikTok. All the links are in the description below, and thanks again. Now, let's get into the video. You can hear me now, though. I muted the wrong thing. All right, so say something real quick, Alex. Testing one, two, three. Welcome to Phasmophobia with the Curious Nerd. Um, we met at TwitchCon, and yeah. now we're now we're meeting in VR to hunt some ghosts. So yeah, we're gonna. Oh, can I carry both these? Oh, yes, I can carry both at the same time. All right, sick. All right, cool. Um, yep. and then I noticed you turn this on and then it stayed on. Yeah, it stays on. I think stay on when you put it on yourself. So something to know. Um, gotta stress before the ghosts. What are those? You got a gun? Okay, hold on. What's up? I didn't. No. I'm just. Everything's cool. No, Don't a, hurt me. It's a thermometer. It's a COVID check. Okay. I'm clean. Uh, five degrees Celsius. You're you're a little cold. I'm a little cold. Um. Well, that's the opposite of sick. So if anything, I'm too healthy. Also, so I the countdown didn't start. So I think technically the door is not open. So we need to open the door. I don't, I don't know how we can open the door. Yeah, I don't know if we can. I don't know. So I don't know if this one, this haunt is broken. What was the name of this ghost? I don't think it had a name. Oh wait, they no, always have a name. I don't know. Dave I just... Marsh. Dave Marsh? Yeah. Okay. Stan Marsh. Dave Marsh. Yeah, but Stan, because South Park. Oh. oh, there is a remains right here. Oh, gross. Okay, so kitchen. Don't, I'm pick, gonna... them up. Don't pick them up. I didn't even take a photo of that yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to set up the camera in here then. Yeah, just in case, yeah. Okay. How do I make sure this is on? I'm not exactly sure. I don't remember. Uh, before you have to like press an additional button. Okay, I think it's on. I have no idea. This other thing has to be. So that that's recording. That's good. But then when I set it here, it closes the thing. I'm gonna go see if it's working. I'll be right back. Good luck. Yep. Timer still hasn't started. Okay. Uh... Yeah, it's definitely working. It's definitely working. What? The camera. We're all good there. I'm gonna go in the basement. Okay. Dave Marsh. Hello, Dave Marsh. Are you here? I'm just gonna open that preemptively. Oh. Dave Marsh, I am alone. Are you here? Hey, uh, I triggered the countdown. I found the door. It was invisible and blocking the garage door. So I just clicked it. Sick. Oh, hey. Oh, yeah. Hey. Just looking around. Yeah, I'm just like monitor. trying to talk to him. See if I can get a response. Basement's kind of um, warm though, so I don't think it's likely here. Oh yeah? Interesting. Yeah. What was the coldest spot so far? Uh, kitchen and hallway. 
I'm turning on the light in the basement. We'll see if that's off later. You said the hallway was the coldest? Oh! It was initially? What? Picked up something on the parabolic mic. Point one. Dave Marsh. Dave? Are you here? Maybe he's upstairs. Okay, you go upstairs. I'm gonna stay down here. Can you say something into my microphone? Almost to a three on the parabolic mic. Dave Marsh, can you make this parabolic mic go to three for me? Seems like he's given us a lot of activity here on the floor, though. Running back out to the truck, getting some tools. Oh man, we hit a uh, ten. We hit a ten in activity. Uh, cool is, close it. The coldest room is uh, ten degrees in the top floor. Ten degrees top floor. Gotcha. You hit a ten in activity. You're at a ten in activity right now. Oh wait, no, you're not. You were a moment ago, though. What else did we need? We needed salt. I guess I'll keep the parabolic mic. Ooh, okay, so... Third floor... We need 50 seconds before we, uh, the haunt, so let's, uh... Yeah, go to that third floor. Yeah, I'm gonna set up some salt there. I, so, that room is cold, right here. This room's cold. Um, well, it gets to 10 degrees. Okay. Um, but I had an EMF-3 here. Right here? Yeah. Well, if that's the case, I'm gonna set this camera up right there. Why do I hear vibrating? Not me or you. I don't know. Yeah, if we stay together, we should oh, be good. Wait, can I put a footprint in the? Okay, we already got a footprint. No. He's, he's opening the door right now. Oh. Oh man, I got the camera. We have also, one. I have the. Damn it. The photo camera. Yeah, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go grab one. Good luck. He likes it when you're alone. Uh, no. Uh, I'm gonna go with you. Oh, why are you doing that? Uh, huh? All right, you go get the camera. I'll stay here. All right. Dan Marsh, can you speak into my parabolic microphone? Oh. Oh, I didn't like that. Dan Marsh, did you just open a door? Oh. Oh, this is scary as shit. He definitely is messing around. That's a camera, it takes photos? No, that's a motion sensor. This is the camera team's photos. Where's the uh, foot? Right there. Right, I'm gonna go downstairs to get a photo of the other thing. Oh! Running this boat. Oh! Do you hear that? No. I just heard ghost noises. Oh shit. Dan Marsh, can you turn on this sink? Can you turn on the sink for me? Can you close the bedroom door? Oh, Jesus Christ. Get the flashlight. Is it the spirit book? Hmm? Is this the spirit book? Yes, yeah. Okay. What? Is that my shadow? Okay. That was freaking me out. Ah. 
Dan Marsh, can you write in the spirit book? Oh, it's cold in here. Okay, so it's freezing temps. Damn, Marsh. I need a parabolic. My one secret thing. Can can you write in the spirit book? Did you take a photo of the uh, bones downstairs? Yeah. Cool. In the bedroom. Sorry, routine light switch, light switch check. Hello, Dave. Dave Marsh. What's this? Oh. Do you hear that? Uh, we should. We should hide. Oh. Oh God. Are you good? Yeah. Are you good? I think so. Okay. That's Ooh, cool to come out. That was, that yeah. was pretty stressful. Yeah. Just got cornered. Okay, so is it this room then? Or is no, it the child's the bedroom? I'm pretty sure it's the hallway. You think it's the hallway? Oh, yeah. oh God! Yeah, right. He just appeared right in front of me. Holy shit. Holy shit. Is the kitchen oh, sink on? He turned on the kitchen sink. Yeah. Oh God. Yeah, I'm getting the hell out of here. Take a picture of the sink. Which sink, where? It's it's this one right here, in the bedroom. Maybe we should go together, stay together. Okay, yeah, yeah. He clo oh wait, it's not in here. It's uh... No, it's a shepherd. We gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta oh, hide. Shit. We gotta go. Get in here, get in here. Oh god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh! They can open the doors now! What the fuck was the monster? Oh. Oh, these got creepier. Oh, what the hell? Oh, I didn't know they could open the doors! Uh, just doing this on the radio, just in case you can hear me this way. Game at level 5, fingerprints, and freezing temperatures. I'm pretty sure it was a gen. Makes sense to me. Um, I think I guessed that it was a gin. Do you just do that by making it blue? Oh, it was the Mimic! It was a Mimic, yeah. So, I... Uh, I thought I had an EMF level five, but I may have been mistaken. It might have been four. I did see, I did see fingerprints, and I did see freezing temperatures. That we definitely really... saw freezing temperatures because we both saw our breath. Yeah. So. Yeah, it must have not been an EMF five, but it it looked like it. It felt like it. <laughs> <laughs> that got really intense all of a sudden. Did our sanity? Oh, nice. We did get the sanity below yeah, twenty five. Yeah, nice. Bonus, that was probably yeah. me because I was walking around in the dark quite a bit. Um, okay, so we're doing, what is this? Grafton farm, oh, a farmhouse? Oh, but it's amateur. Okay, okay. Yeah, so it shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, it um, shouldn't be too bad. Oh, my boy or girl? Presenting. Oh, uh, you're a girl. Nice. Presenting, yeah. I feel like I have kind of manly hands. But anyway. The hands, the hands <laughs> here are kind of weird. Okay, like, yeah. That's not just me? Also, is it, are they leather? Weirdly yeah, they look like weirdly disembodied in leather and like, I don't know, the texture <laughs> on them and the, the reflection on them is really weird. Like I if agree. You hit, like if, you, if you look at the space between your uh, thumb and your index finger uh, and you're like, you're, you you know, you have an open hand yeah. uh, palm towards you, there's like a weird like reflective Did crease. It? Yeah, I see that. I think we're wearing really, really skin tight leather gloves. Okay, so we need motion sensor. Um, 
Cleanse the area near the ghost using smudge sticks. Okay, I haven't used those in a while. That's the sage, right? Yeah. I don't know why they call it smudge sticks. Well, technically it's like smudging and I, I guess not. I don't know. Technically you can smudge of other things. Like in Europe, they smudge of like a lot of other plants. But okay. Like, in North America, it's like people like just only really refer to a sage or like, or they'll like only refer to like white sage because it's like the right, the correct sage, even though that's like sourcing white sage is like really weird and like it's kind of problematic too ethical, because it takes away. Yeah, it's ethi yeah, there's a lot of ethical uh, problems with it. Um, Absolutely. In theory, in theory, you might people may have sources of it like that, that are shitty, but yeah, that's like very little, and it, I doubt anyone that claims it. Oh Definitely. yeah, more more often than not, what you're gonna come across is people buying it. Uh, like I think there's like, I can think of one or two instances where tribes were actually growing and harvesting white sage, and it was benefiting their reservation. But for the mo most majority, it's actually just taking from the religious groups that need it for their ceremonies, which is really yeah. really upsetting. Um, plus, people overuse sage because they don't actually understand how it works. Sage is like spiritual bleach. You're not supposed to be saging your house all the time or saging your space all the time. You should really just sage it if something particularly bad happens or when you first move in. And then past that, it should be cleaning with just incense and um, music yeah. and other things. Like, you don't you don't want to clean out all the positive energy you've built in an area over and over again. Yeah, and there's, uh, al there's alternatives to, like, smudging with sage that isn't, like... Yeah, like, incense, music, all. tons of stuff. Yeah. Um, like, there's, like... Oh, I think as well. Like, there's a lot of stuff. Wait, is there a key? We have to use the house key? Yeah. yeah, you have to use the key to actually unlock the door. That's cool. Because technically, that's what starts the timer up there. Okay. So until you unlock the front door. Oh, right wait, there, name. I forgot to grab the name. I about fell. Oh, you can get in the journal now. Daniel Day Lewis. It's just Daniel Lewis, is but. It? Oh, Daniel Lewis? Wow, okay. <laughs> it's Daniel Day Lewis. Let's oh, go get Lincoln. Head cam. Oh, yeah, good call, good call. Can't go into Lincoln's log cabin without a head cam. Gotta get that POV. You know, if it was, if we weren't normally going into a haunted house with a known murderous ghost, you know, this is pretty, like, nice. Beautiful? Yeah, no, like, this, this would be a vibe in VR chat for sure. But, like, in Phasmophobia, less of a vibe, more of a horror movie setup. <laughs> Oh my god, look at the mu moon. It actually looks beautiful. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's, it's in the, like the stars in the sky. Yeah, you can see the, the Sea of Serenity. Where do I get the key from? No, you just open the door. Oh, it's a. Oh. Whoa. Oh god. The haunting started. Uh oh. Well then. That was interesting. Oh, that can just fell. As soon as we walk in, this can falls. What is that about? Daniel Day Lewis. Oh God, that's got to be him, right? Oh man, yeah. Look at that. We're in this man's house. What's up, YouTube? It's just me and the curious nerd. We're hanging out in Daniel Day Lewis' house. Curious, say hi to the people. Hello. Nice, yeah, I got it on camera. I'm carrying around the tripod. It's a little weird right now, but we're gonna set it up once we find a good place too. Don't worry. Um, welcome to another episode of Ghost Adventurers. I am your host. I think his name was Zach. Daniel Day Lewis. Are you upset that you have not won one more Academy Awards? I did appreciate your work in Lincoln. I thought it was very good. Actually really enjoyed that movie. Robert California's in it from The Office. Oh, I think the parabolic went off. Yep, parabolic's going off over here. Uh, where? Over here, kind of in this room. I'm just gonna set this up uh, right there. Uh, so, right yeah. So like when we first walk in, that can fell from that dresser right there just inside the door and now we're getting parabolic mic and um some temperatures over here so i'm thinking it's piano room is that bone yeah it is it's a jawbone it's a mandible yeah. 
Daniel Lewis, could you please say something into my microphone? Did you knock over this can because we came in your house? Daniel Lewis, are you in this bedroom? I just saw that light flicker, by the way, over there. Oh, yeah, and now I'm hearing ghost noises. That's the parabolic mic, right? Uh, this is the regular light flicker. Yeah, but if I if I hear like rah, 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 that's my parabolic mic going off, right? I think no, that's just uh, it'll talk in your ear. He goes. Oh well, he was just talking in my ear. Daniel Lewis. I'm getting six, eight, three. Oh, he just turned off the light. Sixteen. Two. Yeah, he just turned off the light. I'm hearing noises upstairs. Let's go outside for a second. Let's go get the smudge. Yeah, I would like the, the smudge stick. Alright, I guess walk around the area. Maybe over there. Oh, it's too late. It's already burnt. Yeah, that's it. Oh, and it's freezing over here, too. We just need motion detector. Daniel Lewis, can you walk in front of the motion detector for me? Do you have a camera set up over there? No, we don't. I can go get one because I set one up in the piano room. Uh, where the fuck was the piano room? Oh, that's back over here. Yeah. Oh, yeah, there's an EMF detector over here. If we're looking for orbs... Oh, God. On my desk. Oh, yeah. I hate that. It be happening. This has been a lot of activity over here. Okay, so... Can you pass in front of a motion detector for us? Daniel Lewis, hey, Daniel. can you close the front door? Oh, he turned off the power. He turned off the power? Yeah. Is, let's go wait, outside. Wait, yeah, let's okay. gather some clues real quick. Oh. Okay, so at this point, we've had... Freezing temperatures. We've had... That's it. We didn't get smudge either. Yeah, so it might not be in that spot. Maybe it's in the kitchen. Daniel Lewis, can you talk to me? Can you talk to me? Can you use this spirit box to say something? Daniel? Can you say something into the spirit box?
I'm hearing so many noises. Oh my god, this is horrifying. Daniel, can you say something into the spirit box? Oh. Oh, Jesus! Well, I'll tell you this much, he definitely responds when you're alone. I heard the clinking. I heard the clinking, and it went to 10. I don't know what to tell you. Yeah, no, I, I mean, I saw it went to 10. It looks good together. I was trying to get him to talk into the spirit box. So the, the clinking happened right here on this table. That's probably why the motion sensor didn't get it. Because it happened right here. Yeah, I'm going to move this. Daniel, can you say something into the spirit box? Hey, Alex, look at me. Oh! No, no, why? You suck, dude. I hate you. Welcome back. I've got some jobs ready for you. What did it end up being? On two, okay. On to. Dude, it's always me. They always kill me. It's bullshit. Yeah, that, that was really unfortunate. I think my sanity was just really low. And what you know what kills me? Is right as you and I were walking in that last time, I thought to myself, should I go grab a smudge stick? And then I was like, nah, it's both of us. He prefers people alone. It'll be fine. <laughs> and, and then all the lights flickered, and I was like, oh, God. And then I noticed the door was shut, and I was like, it's probably locked, but I have nowhere else to go right now. So like, I yeah. gotta try this. <laughs> and I tried it, and then I saw the fingers, and I was like, oh, damn it. <laughs> okay, this time I'm not gonna die. We're gonna get the ghost, make all the money, get the crown, save the town, and Mr. Krabs, it's gonna be great. Yeah, the hiding spots here are better. Cool. Oh, wow, this layout looks sick. Always Parabolic Mike. This is a nice ass house. Yeah, this is Eva Mills. Eva? Yeah, Eva. Like, yeah. Oh, okay, gotcha. Four degrees in here. There's something on the floor over here, but not like anything crazy. Um, There's like some candy on the floor right here. I don't fucking know what that's about. Nice, we got a gamer. There's a sick PC set up in here. Three monitors and everything. So all I have is the parabolic mic and the camera. So no. I'm mostly just looking for some bones right now to take a photo of real quick. I don't see anything. Also, I haven't found a Ouija board in any of these yet. Yeah, that's one of the cursed items. Oh, it is? That's a cursed item now? Yeah, so like, you basically, uh, every time the map spawns, there's like a bone and a cursed item. Okay, can you still use the Ouija board? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, there's just more items. Yeah, they really did add a lot, and the graphics even got an update. Yeah. I've this is a pretty nice house. Yeah, this is... I would not mind living here. <laughs> Other than, you know, the whole Eva thing. Oh, I lost my flashlight. Oh, I found 
You found it? Uh, oh, boom. Where? Right, uh, where was it? It was in here, right here. Oh, right here. Got it. Eva, can you say something into this microphone for me? Oh, man. Okay, immediately hit 3.7 on the parabolic in the garage. Eva Mills? Eva Mills? Found the Ouija board! Oh, Pog. I gotta go get my camera. The way I'm holding this... Okay, it actually is doing it. Kinda. No, my hand should be covering the entire shutter, but it's not, but whatever. Oh. Uh, yeah. Alright, we got the... Got the Ouija board. Now we want to set that up somewhere? Yeah. Where do we think the room is, though? I don't know, but by touching that thing and interacting with it, your sanity plummets. Oh, is it? Yeah. yeah. Alright, I'm gonna just leave this here. I remember that, so we might want to go check our sanity real quick. Because we both touched it. Yeah. That was a little reckless of us. <laughs> okay, we're not oh, too bad. Oh, did not get it. Oh, you I did didn't. Get on the How the fuck? It hit 3.7. Like my butt. Alright. It might be one of us. Oh, is that a thing? I'm gonna set the camera down then. Oh, by the way, where do we hide when it comes time to hide? Oh yeah, I'm trying to figure that out for this map. I guess there's the... There are no closets. Closets. Hmm. I think we're just supposed to try and haul ass out of here. I guess yeah. there's a bathroom. These people only believe in wardrobes. Eva Mills. Are you in the garage? I heard a door. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Oh, right here, All five. Right. MF5, right here. In the doorway. What? I'm gonna grab more stuff from the uh, van. Okay. I'm gonna mark that real quick. Evidence MF5. Cool. I think we may have gotten the candle. Eva Mills, can you move this Ouija board? What? I'm just seeing if she can do the Ouija board. Oh, I'm gonna put this thing here. Also. Can you speak to us with the Ouija board? Oh god, I hear her. What is this little book? Oh my oh. god! Oh. Every fucking time! <laughs> oh my god, dude! Oh, oh shattered the Ouija board. You've got this, Alex. I believe in you. Actually, we walk around there a lot. Um, Their curious nature will solve this without me. Wraith or Gorio? So let's see. Hold on. Wraith or Gorio? So we would need fingerprints for this one. 
Amazing. Oh. Fingerprints or dots? And what was the other ghost? Wraith. Spear box. That looks weird. I think the dots projector went off. Um... Okay, so Oni or Gogor or, or Wraith yeah, or Golio. Okay, wish me luck. Don't worry, I'm right next to you even though you can't hear me. Oh, wait a second. I need to turn this on. Yeah, I used up a photo. <laughs> Damn. I'm your guardian angel. Take a picture of the Ouija board. Dots projector no, just went off. No, no, no. Bye. Bye. Absolutely not. Hello. That is gross. Hey, Eva. Yo, Eva. <laughs> the dots projector went off that last time. Damn, it was a oh, Gorio, yeah. wasn't it? No spirit. Oh, spirit. Damn. Oh, I got a level up. Tripod, 42 Edgefield Road, 10 Ridgeview Court. Cool. Um, and I have $171. Nice. Uh, by the way, that last time when she showed up <laughs> and you were like, oh, fuck this. She literally popped up right behind the plant in the corner of the room and she was just sitting there. It was horrifying. And her whole mouth was just like a giant circle with rows and rows of teeth. That's horrifying. Yeah, it was terrifying. Like, it was just a little girl, and the re I don't know if you heard me scream when she went to murder me, but, like, everything yeah. everything got weird in the living room, and then I turn over, and by the couch is this little girl just, like, crawling up at me, and I was like, oh, my God! And I was, like, trying to run away. And then I felt hurt the noise, and I was like, oh, God, it's over. That was horrifying. And then all of a sudden, like, yeah. just, it's always me. Every time. <laughs> like, Yeah, the ghosts seem... They know they know you're streaming. I'm pretty sure you're slapping a sticker on my back when we walk in, like, get me first or some <laughs> shit. And so I'm just walking around like, hey, Eva. And I've got this freaking sticker on my back that just says, like, I don't believe in ghosts or some shit like that. <laughs> yeah. I, I promise I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> I don't trust you. That was really fun. Oh, my God. Do you see that? Yeah. That's also like some American corner. horror story apocalypse oh no i didn't see that that's deeply unsettling <laughs> during that level on super mario galaxy 2 the eyes track you yeah walk closer to it oh yeah no it's it's that is not okay Thanks again for watching, you guys. Those of you who are watching on YouTube, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Follow me at Half Pint Streams on Twitch and TikTok to catch my best clips and see us live. I've just been smashed into oblivion by four ghosts. But uh, yeah, this has been me and the Curious Nerd um, playing some Phasmophobia. We'll definitely be playing probably more of this and definitely more VR in general. I really don't like you staring at me, guy. I'm just trying to do my thing over here and creeping. Making me feel weird about it. Just, uh. All right, anyway. Yeah, thanks again for watching, everyone. That's going to do it for me. Uh, see you later, Warehouse. Catch you on the flippity flip. Thanks for watching, guys. Follow me on Twitch to join us live. Like and subscribe, and I will catch you later.